Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be looking at Final Girl from Van Ryder Games, Season 1. I've got set up in front of me Camp Happy Trails with Hans the Butcher. And we're going to have a quick playthrough. I'm not so much going to go through the rules, I'm just going to play. You guys can watch and see if I, well, when <laughs> I lose. This game is brutal. If you haven't played it, it's hard. It's good. It is a really good game, but it is very hard. Of uh, the last five games, I've only won one. <laughs> I'm just setting up the items. And to be fair, the items are not too bad at all. And we'll see where everybody goes. I am doing this relatively quickly, but all I'm doing is putting down my victims, putting down where I start and where Han starts. Setting up the items. You've got three item locations where you can search for items. And that's what these three guys at the top are. So in the cabin, there's a lucky rabbit's foot. In the dock, there's a bear trap. And in the utility shed, we have an aluminium bat, which I like the sound of. Hans is an absolute brute. He's a machine. He is your typical, like, <clears throat> Freddy, not Freddy. He's like a Jason or Michael Myers. He's got a ton of health. He doesn't move very fast, but when he hits you, it hurts. And I am the final girl, so it's my job to try and rescue victims and kill him and try not to be killed myself. I'm playing as Rico. Rico starts with six health and Han starts with 12. We're gonna draw an event card and see what the first event is. Secret tunnel. This isn't a bad one actually, it's quite a good one. I've had this before. I get to create a tunnel from the um, locations, the searching locations. I can make them adjacent to each other. So I can go from utility shed to cabin, cabin to dock. Um, I think I'll go one in cabin and one in the utility shed. So if I need a speedy exit, nip down the tunnel. Hands can't come down the tunnel, so that's quite handy. Okay, we are good to go by the look of it. Time is set to six. Hurry track is on four. Ties you up in the corner where that needs to be. Let's go. I think I'm going to start. Um, I'm thinking of going for these two first. I feel like with the tunnel now at the top, it'll be easier to get around the top. Make out point is always a difficult one to get to because it's on its own and there's no shortcut to it. It's kind of just out there. So we'll start with a walk action. I'm gonna roll two dice. Two dice is indicated on horror track. And nothing. And that means discard, uh, discard two cards to make one success. So I discard a focus. I discard a short rest because I don't need it and I get to walk one space and lose one time. So I'm going to join this, sorry, this victim. That's my first action done. And second, I'm going to walk again. And the same thing. Discard two and walk one. Now when I move, I can take one, uh, sorry, two people with me when I move. Which is good and bad. Sometimes you'll find yourself with multiple people you want to save and you need just to leave poor old Timmy behind and wish him good luck and try and get back to him later. Right, that's the end of my go. I've used all my cards. So you basically have a bunch of cards with zero time on them. They're yours, they don't cost anything to pick up. And I have five time to spend. I will get a search for two 
and I'll get a sprint for two. And it leaves me one more, I'll get a close call for one. So that's all spent. And I'll go back up to six for the next round, and now it's the killer turn. The killer doesn't move, he stays where he is and just stabs because he's an angry little beaver. And I'm going to pull a tarot card. Horror track goes up one. For every victim that is dead, hands recovers a heart, but nobody's dead, so that's not a bad one to start with, and then it's back to me. I will... I think I'm going to sprint. I'm going to try a sprint. Perfect. Move up to three spaces. That's fantastic news. So I'm going to move two, and take these guys with me. So one, two, there, three, and now I get a third, and I'm going to be in the dark. These two guys are safe. So I can... I don't want to move spaces because I like what I am. I'll take two more time. Can't take any hearts because I'm already maxed out. I'll take the planning card. The planning card just means I get more dice to roll. So I'd have to roll dice if I get two stars, it means I get three dice for my next roll. Okay, so two saved and I'm in the dock. Let's search the dock. That's bad. This comes up one and I lose the time. And I lose the search. Fantastic. Okay, in that case, let's just try and get away from hands. So, we'll discard two to walk. Let's go. Short rest and focus to, sorry, walk. So, I get to move, lose one time, and move one space. I do the right thing, I do that, save these two. And that means move one space, move one space. By hands. <laughs> I'm getting out of here. Whatever I left. Mm, we could try a focus. It could be terrible if we don't get two successes. Let's give it a go. Of course. That, that's my luck this game. I'll lose two time. I'll lose the focus. I will use... Do I use the walk? I think I use the walk. Let's try another walk. Hmm. I think I'll just take the one. Move one space. And end my go. So I'll get back my free cards. Search goes back, sprint goes back. Try and keep it somewhat tidy in here. <laughs> and onto the killer phase. So the killer still doesn't walk. So let's pull a tarot card. He wants me. He's always wanted me. He's gonna move two spaces towards me. One, two. And that's it, back to me. I've got one to spend. Well, close call it is. And back up to six. Let's walk again. You focus, short rest. And walk for one and lose one time. Walk again. Focus and a weak attack. Lose one time. Okay, I've got no searches and I've got no more walks. So to get to this guy, it's one, two, three, four, five. Or use the turn and go one, two, three, four, five. It's the same thing. OK, 
Okay, I'm gonna end my go. Okay, I've got all my cards. I've got support to spend. I'm gonna take a search. Oh yeah, I'm gonna pick two searches. One, two, one, two. And that goes back up to six. And hands his go again. So again, he doesn't move. He just pulls a Sarah card. He just keeps coming. This time he's going to evict him or me and move for one. So one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. It's the same. Let's go up there. And we're going to search. I'll discard a focus. I'll discard a short rest. Search one. Cabin. Lucky rabbit's foot. The lucky rabbit's foot says, sorry, discard during action phase to make a horror roll. Each star, I get two more time, one more heart, one less on the horror track, which I like, or move one space. Okay, well that's the search. Do I want to search again, or do I want to go up to the utility and potentially get the aluminium bat? Let's search again. See if we get a good item. Discard two for a search. So this comes down, sorry, one for the last search and one again for this search because I forgot to do it previous. Focus and I'll get rid of a weak attack and search again. An energy drink. Discard during an action phase. Move one space or gain three time. I think I'm going to use this now and gain three time. Take up to seven. I'm going to walk. Nice. Move down one. Move two spaces. I'm just going to do a casual walk. One, two. These guys are saved. Now, um, could have gained an extra heart there, but I can't. But what I can do is flip Rico's card to her kick and butt side and it says one per action phase if the enemy is within two spaces you may move that enemy move to that enemy's space for free okay I've got one more walk I'll do it I'll do it and move on space I'll use this to try and re-roll. Same thing. Damn. Right, so I'll just move on to base. That's the walk action. I'll finish it there. Getting back my free cards, get rid of the close call. Get rid of the search and the search. And these will come back to me. And his hands is go. So he's still not moving. He just pulls another terror card. He just keeps coming. He's going to move for one and stab for one. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. It doesn't really matter where he goes. Nice. We like that. I've got plenty to spend. I'll take a search for two. Take a sprint for two. Okay. I'm gonna walk to begin. I'm walking one, so that resets. I'm walking one. And get that person safe. Okay, there's the walk gun. Now I will try to sprint. Not great. <laughs> I'll get rid of a focus. I'll get rid of a short rest. I go down one. I get to move two spaces still. So I could go one, two, try and get to make out point. Got another walk to use. Down one more. Move one. Okay, at least I'm making out with somebody down at the uh, water side. That's romantic. 
Um, okay. I think I'm gonna end it there. And again, bring back my cards, get rid of my sprints. Killer phase, still not moving. Under that horror card. He kept swinging his hammer and killing and killing. If there are no victims on the board, discard a draw. Well, there are. So he's gonna move towards the victim once and stab. One stab, and then he's gonna do the same thing again with one more stab. That's the end of that. Back to me. Um, right, I didn't buy my cards last one, did I? I'm just gonna pull that sprint back. Zero that. Okay, we need to get to those guys. Problem is I've got three victims to save. I can only move two at a time. So I could risk going near Hans, but not the best idea, or I could cut across the water, try and save this one on their own first and get to the duck and search. I think I'll do that. Only reason being, I, I want some weapons. I'm gonna move the two, take it with me. We're swimming. We just had a make out, now we're swimming. We're on a great day. And then we'll walk for one. Sorry about that. Walk for one, I was correct. Down one time. And then somewhere, I've got a search, yes. Let's give it a go. Okay. Go for the short rest and the focus for one search. Take the top item in the duck. Bear trap. I'm not mad at that. I'm not mad at the bear trap. The bear trap means I can spend two time and place it in my space, not in the lake and then discard the card. If the killer walks into the bear trap, he takes two damage. That's pretty good. Okay, what's left? Let's try and walk and get this, this victim out of here. Okay, we'll walk the one. Victim safe. Good. Now I just need to get back up to the other victims and try and get them out of here and get a weapon to try and do some damage to hands. That walk's gone because I've just used it. Okay, end of my go, back to hands. Again, he's not moving, he's going to draw a terror card. And it says he wants fresh blood. If there are no victims on the board, there are victims on the board. He's going to move two and stab one. So one, two and stab. They're still okay for now. I do need to get them out of there. So it's one, two, three locations. I've got two to spend. I'm gonna have to take a sprint into my hand for two. That zeros. Get back my free card. Free, free, free. Okay. So I'm going to try and sprint and get over there. I'm going to discard two and sprint for three. One, oh, one two, three. So I made it, which is great. Let's do a walk. Do a walk action, of course. Focus now. Mm -hmm. Focus in a weak attack can go for walking for one. I'm gonna walk for one and take them with me over here. Okay. I'm gonna try and walk again. I think I'm just gonna lose the time on that one. Over to the killer phase. Just gonna take a terror card. That wasn't good. 
I'm in the red. I get one dice. Uh, he's gonna call one. Not good. Not good at all. Let's see if I can get my dice back. I need this to be a star. I've just noticed I've got two time I didn't spend. Do I take a search? Or do... I'm going to take a search. Sorry about that. So that goes there, that goes there. Right, so I rolled the one for the focus. Which means I come out and I get one dice back. That was good. That was good. So the focus is out of it. And then I'm going to search. Short rest can go. Weak attack can go. I'm going to search and take the top item in the cabin. And it's a pepper spray. If the killer is in your space, you may discard this to immediately end the killer's phase. Ignore the remaining movement, attack, and any other effects. Okay, not bad. I'll take it. Not bad at all. Move for one. Move for one. I'll discard. I discard the close call and focus. Move two. If I go one, two, I'm three spaces away. One, two, yeah. one, two. And then I've got one walk left to try and get them out of here. <laughs> I can't do that. So, down two time. Again, three cards come back. Search goes away. Back to the top. I've got two to spend. Two to spend. Can't really do much with two. I know he's going to come for me soon. I'm tempted to get the guard. Definitely tempted to get the guard. Or keep searching and try and get a better weapon. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to use the two and put down the bear trap where I am. That's what I'm going to do. Okay, back to the top. I've only got my three cards in my hand. Killer phase. I'm getting very low on these cards. He came out of nowhere. I know what this means. He's gonna pop up where I am. Draw the next Terra card. Oh, and I go down to one dice. This ain't getting good, people. Place two new victims in the space when you started. Where did I start? Oh, in there. <laughs> Convenient. We're all together. And. Go down even more. I can't. I'm on one die. Draw an event card. Okay, if anyone goes in the lake, they are gonna. Dark waters. If anyone goes in the lake, they're immediately killed. Wow. Okay, so we've got a bear trap. So he's just walked into my bear trap, which is good. So I'll hurt him for two. That's a decent start. I'm gonna walk and at least try and rescue some of these people. I've got one die. Um, a focus can go, and a short rest can go, and we'll walk for one. I'm gonna take two with me. These two are still left with him. I'm 
try to focus. Oh, sorry, I was supposed to take that down. Come on, start. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna get rid of those to focus up for one and get my dice back. I need it. End of my go. Killer phase. So the killer is gonna stab for one. His first murder is on the board. Oh, sorry, no. He kills for two because the knife is over here. It indicates every time he kills, he has two stabby stabs. So they're both gone. Yep. It's just me and him. Terror guard, last terror guard. Isn't going well. You can't save us, no one can. If there are no victims on the bar, on the board, discard and draw the next terror card. I cannot do this. So I assume I flip over and go to his final form. Butcher Bloodlust. So every time it's the killer phase, his bloodlust goes up. He moves two spaces towards me and stabs for two. Okay, so I've got four, four to spend. Four, retaliate, furious strike I could buy, Let's get my three cards back in my hand. I'm gonna go for a furious strike. One, two, three, four, That's zeros. Okay, back to me. So, remember I'm Rico, so once per action phase, if an enemy was in two spaces, I can move straight there for free. So I can go there, and I'm gonna try and use my Furious Strike. Not good. Focus can go. Uh, two focus can go. <laughs> and I get to hurt him for one. I go back down to one die. And it ends my go immediately. Okay, so he's going to go up on Bloodlust. He's not gonna move because he's already with me. He's going to stab me. But he's not, because I'm gonna use my pepper spray. If the killer is in your space, you may discard this immediately and end the killer's go. Well, that was lucky. Okay, back to me. Um, Furious is gone. These two come back. I do have six to spend now, so that's good. Critical blow. Mm, do I want critical blow? That'll hurt him for three. I really want a weapon. But every time he moves, he's gonna move twice. So if I take sprints, it's like he'd sprint away from me pretty quickly. Let's go sprint for two. Let's go retaliate for four. And I'll turn you back up to the top. <clears throat> I'm going to use my lucky rabbit's foot to get me out of that and get me a die back. And let's run. <laughs> okay, I need to get out of here, so I'm going to use my focus. Um, no, I'm going to use sorry, focus and a short rest. Dump, bucket, and get out three spaces. So I'm going to go one, two. Three. Okay. I think I'm going to end it there. Because I just want to buy some researchers while I'm there. Yeah, I will. So back to him. Bloodless goes up. He's going to move to one, two, and stab the air. And I've got five, so I'm going to take a search for two.
got a three. I take a guard for two. I take a close call for one. Okay. Get rid of the sprint. That comes back, that comes back. Back to me. Where is that search? Okay. Get rid of the short rest and focus again and search one. So I'm in the utility shed and I get an aluminium bat. So it has to be in the same location. And I basically get to damage him one extra. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You can only have ten cards in your hand. That comes off the board because I've already used that. Sorry. I'm going to try and focus up. Lose a time, but we go back up, so that's not terrible. I'll take that. Five. What can I buy? I'm going to end my go there again. So as good this goes up. Gonna move to. I've got five to spend. I take a furious strike. Search. Um, can't take my short rest because I have ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Short rest stays out. Okay, so I can get him, I'm two spaces away, so let's do that. So one, two, I use Rico's power to get to him. Oh. Where is my planning? I use my planning. Focuses. Where's that plenty cap gone? And I stay with two dice. But I lose a time. Okay, Furious Strike. Oh, I need to, I need to get rid of two cards. I'll get rid of the close call. I'll get rid of a walk. Can't not do two damage. So, damaging for two. And that goes up. Sorry, wrong card. So that's Furious Strike done. And then I've got a weak attack. Perfect. Damage him for one more. But what I haven't been doing is every time I attack him, I get an extra. So I get one more for the Furious, and then I get one more for the Weak. Brilliant. Okay, and then I've got to walk. It doesn't really matter, because he's going to walk for two anyway. I might as well not do it. Okay, I'll stay where I am. Killer phase, the Lulus goes up, so now he's going to attack for three. Attack for three. But I do have a guard and I retaliate, so I'll retaliate. Sorry, the guard. I'll guard first, so I'll roll die, see how much damage I take. So 
So I can't discard cards because I've only got two cards. So he's going to hit me for two because I get rid of one. So I lose. I'll take the one. I lose two. Four. And then I'm going to retaliate to him. Hit him for one. Reduce the attack. So I hit him for one, I believe. That's how that works. And that'll be the end of my go. I've got a war card, but there's no point in using it. I've got four to spend, so let's sort this out. So Retalia goes back, Gaia goes back. Weak attack comes back to my hand, Furious goes up, Walk comes back, First Ball goes out, Planning goes back out, Focus, Short Rest, Short Rest. Okay, four. Better to say that retaliates, he's going to hit me again. It goes all the way down, resets. Killer phase, bloodless goes up, oh, now it's going to hit me again for three. So I lose three. Reduce one damage and damage him for one. So he hits me for two, and he loses one. Natalia is gone. Let's try. We can try a short rest. <coughs> Fantastic. Let's get rid of the walk. We don't need it. Focus. Let's do one short rest. So we go down in time. Better go to half back. Okay. Let's go again for a weak attack. Ay, ay, ay. Not good. I damage him for one. Plus one two, but I also lose a heart. Let's see what he's got left. He gets one. I did forget to do this. That doesn't matter because there's no victims. Okay. So end of my go, three cards come back. And then I've got again five to spend. Here we go again. I'm going to take a close call as well, just to help me out if I need it. Now he's going to hit me again for three. He's going to hit me for three. I've only got two there. I've only got two, so I have to retaliate. Okay, so I'm going to get rid of my close call to reroll one. Same thing, doesn't matter. So one, two, three, four. Ignore all damage for two. Yes! Yes. Okay. I think I played that legit. <laughs> if I didn't, somebody comment. But I think I just did that on camera. I am very happy right now. Hans has fallen to little Rico. Fantastic. And that couldn't have gone better. I saved a bunch of people, only two died. I think I did that good. Comment if I didn't. I want to know where I went wrong. I've got the others still to play. So I need to make sure I get this right. But I'm pretty sure that was legit. I'm feeling a bit red in the face now. I'm emotional. <laughs> Hands has fallen. Good. Great. Brilliant. Wow, I'm speechless. I am speechless. That is a fun game. It's, it's nice and quick paced as well. You do go through your cards really fast. Um, at times I tried to slow things down just so you guys can keep up rather than just go, 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 go. Um, but 
that did not take long at all to get through. So if anyone wants a fun game that it sets up relatively fast, it's got so much variability, it's unreal. You get a bunch of characters, a bunch of different setups. So if you want your island, your island, your location set up differently, you can do. The event cards are really fun. You never know what's gonna come up. It's really, I mean, get a boyfriend. Why not? Somebody becomes the damned. Why not? I mean, even the location cards. I mean, across archery bow, we didn't even get that. That would have come in handy and that would have made life even easier. You can hurt him from two locations away, but we didn't need it. That was Hans the Butcher. Thank you for watching Camp Happy Trails. I'll put up another one of these soon. Let me know how I got on. See you in the next one. Have a great day.